Sometimes a selfie camera of an iPhone Model 10 onwards gets damaged. It may be by moisture, stains, or scratches on the lens, or some other reason. But even though it's damaged, the front camera may still work perfectly well, and the Face ID or Facial Identification System as well. If the complete front camera of the module is replaced, the Face ID will be lost, as this module contains the dot projector, which in turn is paired with the motherboard. If you want to see everything related to the failure of the Face ID and how to repair it, visit our video that we've posted in the link with the description of this video just below. Now, in this video, we'll do a simple procedure to change the front camera, remove it from the camera module and replace it with a new one, all without losing the Face ID. This iPhone 11 Pro Max device has some blue and green stripes on the front camera that make the selfie pictures look smudged. And as we can see, the same device has a perfectly working Face ID. Okay, let's start with the repair. Step one, we carefully remove the camera module because with the slightest the slightest movement, the Face ID can be damaged. The slightest movement. Step two, we'll use a new camera module and we'll use these pliers to cut the shield that contains the camera. Once cut along the edge, we open the shielding and use a cutter to remove the glue that holds the camera inside the module. We can take it out and remove what's left of the glue. Step three, we'll do a similar procedure with the original camera module of the phone to remove the old and damaged camera and fit the new one. But in this case, we'll do it even more gently. We'll use some heat and a Qian Li 011 tool to remove the glue between the shielding and the dot projector. Now we use the pliers in order to break the shielding that holds the front camera and the dot projector. Once broken we can bend it and with the cutter we carefully remove the traces of glue from around the front camera. Now we need to use a little force with the cutter and remove the camera. Step 4. We clean the remains of the glue from the original module of the shield that holds the camera and once clean we can position the new camera. Now before fixing the new camera with glue to the original module, we must check that everything works correctly. In this case, the front selfie camera is as good as new, and the Face ID also works perfectly. We've changed the front camera without having to change the whole module, and consequently, without losing the Face ID. For spare parts such as the front camera of an iPhone 10 onwards, or many others, and for tools, visit fourphones.eu. Thank you very much for watching our video. Until next time, this was Four Phones, more than spare parts.